if you look at the screen here, this pink line is actually in my wettest core. And if you look right about here, I reached 10% moisture content. So it took me about the same amount of time to go from 60% down to 10% as it's gonna take me to get from 10% down to my target four. This is the CS Woods difference. We don't stop here. I'm not good until I reach 4%. And this is what I call the gray area of drying. This is the difference in between my wettest core and my driest core. And I could very easily say this whole kiln load reached 10% here. But that was my wettest core. This is what I call the gray area of kiln drying. It's the difference in between your wet spot in your wood and your dry spot in your wood. 